Okay, so today we're going to be talking about the sessions you did at home and what we did in today's session and what you're doing at home this week. So if you can uh, tell me about how these sessions went at home and what you thought of them. Yeah, okay. Uh, so we'll start off with the run. Um, I thought that was very good. I felt it benefited me quite a bit. Um, it was set for 20 minutes, but obviously I only competed 15. But yeah. hopefully as the weeks go on, I can increase that. Um, I used the RP chart to help me with the intensity of it and to make me aware of what levels I'm using. Okay. So when I first started, I started at RP2. Mm. So that was just like a light jog. <coughs> and then as, I, as it went on, I increased it to about Which 6, way? 7. Yeah. And then the last five minutes of it, I brought it back down to a slow-paced jog. Yeah. To, to get my heart rate back down. Okay, that sounds good. And then good. I recorded, obviously, the evidence. And then the second training was a sprint arm action. Yeah. I completed that at home. Um, obviously, I'm going to give it to you on video as well, so you That's can see. Yeah. Um, I didn't really feel that like this training was, you know, beneficial to me. It's because okay. I didn't really felt like it was doing anything. Yeah, but, um, that's fine. Okay. It was a good thing to use, but I just don't think it's right. It wasn't beneficial to you. That's yeah. fine. Okay, I'll take that on board and um, change a couple of things around for uh, next time. Okay. So, <clears throat> if we go on to uh, the sessions that I'd like you to do uh, this week, now it seems like a lot of writing, but uh, it's not, not actually that much. It'll probably take you, I think, about half an hour, maybe a little bit longer to complete these. So, the first one that I'd like you to do, which is a 20 minute run, again, the same as before. And I'd, if you can, again, you know, use the RP chart to yeah. look at your intensities and, you know, maybe for the first five minutes, start off with a light jog and then increase it and work your way up. Um, and if you can uh, take notes, again, you know, just for evidence so I can see what yeah. RP you've been running at. Um, and then for the second one, we've got um, three different exercises that I'd like you to do uh, with a ball. And um, if you can, get somebody to video you doing each of the exercises uh, with a ball. So uh, the first one that uh, you'll be doing is uh, sitting on the floor and having the ball in front of you. And then bring it round to the left and the right hand side of you, just touching it behind your back. Um, and then the second one that I'd like you to do is um, sit on the floor and have uh, the ball in front of you with your legs slightly wide apart and um, and then push the ball forwards and then bring it backwards and I'd like you to do that uh, four times each so repeat it four times and then for the last exercise we've got uh, the plank and if you can hold the ball out in front of you obviously the tummy's got to be off the, off the ground and have your toes on the floor behind mm -hmm. and then hold that for one minute and if you can obviously get it all videoed for uh, evidence. Does that sound? Yeah, that sounds fine. That sounds good? Okay. Yep. Okay, so we've got a today's session that we did, and how did you think that went? Did you think it was beneficial uh, at all? Yeah, or? I thought it was yeah. really good today. Yeah, the weights were really beneficial. I felt good. like I did like a proper workout, and good, I good. feel like it's doing what I needed to do for my goal, so yeah, yeah. it's all good. So you happy with everything? Yeah, that's yeah. fine, yeah. Okay, cool. Thank you.